Mama. No way. Mama. No way. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Get out of here. What's up, YouTube world? Shout out to my crew. And welcome back to another video, video, video. Amiable soul and entertainment. Coming through to see that ASC, ASC, come by with the family. Knowledgeable, radiant, and elevating. We were the ASC, ASC. My goal is to entertain, manifesting all my dreams. Might teach you a couple things. ASC, ASC, right where you need to be. That ASC, 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 amiable soul. Okay, guys, so as you can see, we are back with another video. Of course, I have a special guest again, my mom, because if you have not seen the first video, we actually already did her Ancestry DNA results testing with Ancestry DNA. Um, if you have not seen that video, then I strongly advise for you to go and check that video out first. I would try to link that video either in the description box below, or you can click the I card in the corner one of these corners over here and go check that video out first so you can kind of see what we found out first because this is not an initial reaction to her results in general now we're about to get into her 23 and me results as much as i love 23 and me and have been waiting on getting these results for her forever and i've been excited for forever we finally got them now. So, you know, I would say I, everybody's experience ain't the same. Right. Everybody's like, experience may. Be, we just happen to have a bad. Maybe it's, maybe it's her. A, a bad time. Maybe it's her. <laughs> let's just blame the, may, may, Let's just blame it on her. We'll yeah. let 23 and me redeem themselves this time. Because I've taken the test successfully. I don't know what was going on with her, but let's just say you might have to wait a little bit longer depending on who you are. But everybody's test results may not be as lengthy. Okay? So without further ado, let's get into this video. So oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm just gonna say, wait, let's just cover it real quick. Let's just cover it. Okay, wait. <clears throat> let me let me sit my All right, okay, okay, it says, Tammy, it's about, no, Tammy, it's time to learn more about your DNA story. Your ancestry and traits results based on your DNA are now available. So we're just gonna get straight to the results because that's what we really been waiting, waiting for, okay? Let's just get to that. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I wanna be able to show it without it like, Showing everything. I don't think there's a way I can do that right now. So we just got to go through it. Okay, I'm gonna just scroll a little bit at a time. So right now it says you are 100% Tammy. Yes. <laughs> and you I are. Am me. <laughs> <laughs> and you are 85% Sub Saharan African. Okay, so 85, that's pretty high. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right, so we know now you are 65.1% West African out of the Sub-Saharan African, which is broken down to 98.7% Nigerian. 28. I, what did I say? 98.7. Oh, oops. 28.7. <laughs> I mean, if it was 98.7, I'm, I'm jumping out my seat so Right. <laughs> you would both. 28.7%. Nigerian. Let's see, twenty one point five percent Ghanaian, Liberian, and Sierra Leonean, which that's like all on the West Side Ivory Coast area. Okay, that's not bad. Twenty one point seven, twenty one point five percent. Okay, seven point five percent Senegambian and Guinean, which is still West Africa. Okay. 
All right, so that's, that's out of West Africa. Now we're getting into Congolese and Southern East African. So that's like, we're moving further in a little bit and going down, which is not as common. A lot of us are a mixture of African, but a lot of us are mainly West African. So when we start getting into like South Central Africa, that's like deeper history. We might have to figure out how, I don't know. But you are 16.7% Congolese and su Southern East African, breaking that down to 14.3% Angolan and Congolese. Dang, okay. That's crazy. So we don't know exactly if it's Angolan or Congolese, but they're kind of like, I think they're really close to each other. And it's mainly in Central Africa. Hmm. Okay, so you're 0.7% Southern East African. Okay. okay, okay. So what else then? Oh, you got 0.3% African hunter gatherer. That would be way back. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Oh, we out of Africa now. So that was your Africa. So now we are in Europe. You are 11. 0.4% European. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you are 10.1% Northwestern European. Okay, so it broke that down. So you're 5.9% British and Irish. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and it was able to pinpoint that. So... Wow. We British and Irish somewhere. And wow. you are 0.4% French and German. Mm. Okay. Well, yeah. I think most African is mama's side. Most of Yeah, the mama, African definitely got to be coming from grandma's side. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> you ain't got that stuff, do you? No, I ain't got that stuff. <laughs> So Southern European, you're 0.6%. Southern European, with that being 0.5%, Spanish and Portuguese. Wow. So we Espanol. I knew there was a reason I can speak my Espanol. Hola, como estas? <laughs> Hola, como estas? Me amo Caitlin. Me amo um, Tammy. Oh, <laughs> que nico, que nico. Bienvenidos a mi canal. Gracias, gracias, muchísimo gracias, mi gente. Ah, uh, y'all ain't know. Y'all ain't know. I told you that Spanish is in there. Mm. She got to teach her mama now. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, that's, that's why I can roll my R's, you know. That's why I can. It's in there. It's in my DNA. It's in my blood. Let's see. So 2.2% East Asian and Native American with 1.4% Native American. And you are 0.5% <laughs> Chinese and Southeast Asian. So I knew that, that was something. It, huh? I knew there had to be something up in there because Papa's picked up on some Asian. Wow. Oh, you always broke it down. What? It says 0.2% Indonesian, Thai, Kamor, or Mayama. That's what where your that? Asian traces to. I don't know. Let's uh, find out. Well, we know Indonesian. I've never heard. Yeah, I heard of Indonesian. Or Thai. And Thai. Right? Yeah, but I've never heard of Get Kimura, out of here. Khmer and Myanmar. What? Indonesian. Sorry if I'm butchering that. If y'all are from these places, I'm so sorry. I don't know how to pronounce this. Yeah. But just know we right here. We right here. We a part of y'all now. We we understand that now. Where wow. is that coming from? <laughs> <laughs> so you have to do some research on Southeast Asia because yeah. one of your great, 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 great grandmas or grandfathers is Southeast, Southeast Asian. Asia. Maybe wow. Indonesian or Thai. Whatever Myanmar is. That's crazy. I don't, I'm going to have to look into that one. Indonesian, Thai. 
Mm. I wonder which one it is. It doesn't tell you exactly which one, but I mean, I guess because they're Who's all probably in the same area. Mm -hmm. What else? There's something else. There's something else? Yeah. Wow. Western Asian and North African, 0.7%. Let's see. With that being Northwest Asian. Whoa. It's what breaking yours down. What is that? See. Y'all, help help me out. drop it. Put in the comments below how we say this stuff. Correct us, cause I don't know. Okay, I, I really don't Cypriot. know. Cypriot, Cypriot, C Y P R I O T. Cypriot. Let's see Cypress what that C -Y -P is. Northwest Cypriot. Asian Cypriot. What? <laughs> Never heard of this. Okay. Anyway, Cypriots were speaking a form of Greek which remains the language spoken across half of the island, even after long periods of Egyptian, Persian, Venetian, Ottoman, and British rule. Hmm. You know, and that could be where that came from. If they had British rule, some British could have mixed with some Cypriot yeah. people. I didn't even heard of this place before. Thanks. Greek and Turkish speaking Cypriots. And what's crazy is I think Pawpaw is part Greek. I gotta look at his, is he, was he? He's something. Maybe. I gotta look in these areas and I think once I do that, all this stuff is gonna make sense. But, hmm, but what is, I gotta look that up. That's, that's different. I've never <laughs> even seen anybody with this result. Like this, I'm, I don't think I've seen any African American with this result. And I've watched a lot of these videos. When I say I watched a lot of 23andMe videos, I watched a lot of 23andMe videos, especially of our people. And I have not seen this result with our people. So I don't know where this is coming from, but I, okay. <laughs> All right then, let's go back. And then you have 0.7% that was undersigned, meaning they could not figure out exactly what you are because you're alien. <laughs> they didn't get the results. They didn't finish getting the results from Venus. I told you. Oh, my they God. Were waiting, but they had to go ahead and send it before they got the result back. Mama. No way. Mama. No way. What? <laughs> what? Get out of here. Get out. this though because is, where is that coming from okay for y'all don't do don't see what oh. we're talking about <laughs> we're freaking out because it says we have recent ancestry in the americas it says caribbean and then it specified it in jamaica meaning we might be descendants of jamaicans and we didn't notice this whole time so who is jamaican i don't know mine <laughs> I'm about to freak out. Like, <laughs> wow. Why is this picking up Jamaican and the other one didn't pick up any Caribbean communities? But didn't that's why I like this one. Detailed. Yeah, that's why I like this one. Because I feel like they just, I don't know, they test different things and they pick up a lot more stuff that Ancestry doesn't. Not saying that I don't like Ancestry. I think that it's good to take both so you can really compare and contrast. But I like 23andMe because it just seems a little more diverse. Like they're really pinpointing your DNA to specific areas and not just kind of saying, oh, you African-American, let's just pop some Africans and European and maybe a sprinkle of Native American. Not saying they're not mm -hmm. accurate. I do believe they have, you know, accurate results. I just think their databases and their algorithms are different. And I just happen to like 23andMe a little bit better because... Let's be honest, it just seems like it's giving more you a detail. lot more details, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
So, wow, what is going on? That's pretty interesting. <laughs> what is going on? Wow. I, I, would, that, I wasn't even expecting that. I don't even think I had any uh, communities on mine. So Crazy. Click, what click on that, that coming that, from? See what that's Recent ancestry. What's the I still could be my cousin. It's Caribbean. So. What? <laughs> She my Caribbean Your DNA cousin. suggests that you had Caribbean <laughs> ancestors. Evidence of human habitation in the Caribbean dates back over 7,000 years, but the region's indigenous populations collapsed within decades after Spanish expeditions. Could be where our Spanish came from, mixing way back then with the Jamaicans or something. First, <clears throat> made contact with the native Arawak oh, peoples in the Bahamas, Cuba, Hispaniola people. Mm, I can't read. Most people <laughs> from the Caribbean now have predominantly European or West African ancestry. What? In the last 200 years, your ancestors may have lived in the following locations. What? Jamaica. Highly likely match. What does that mean? That means that it's very likely that, that we, we are descendants religion. of Jamaicans. Get out of here. That doesn't have to be highly. That means they're suggesting that your DNA is basically saying you match Jamaican. That's why I love reggae, man. <laughs> I just <laughs> listen to it. German. Oh, my God. German. Yeah, no, don't put her notes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. What is this? We did not detect enough evidence of recent ancestry from Antigua, Bar, Barbuda, Buda. Aruba, the Bahamas, Barbados, Barbados. Cuba, <laughs> Dominica, <laughs> and the Dominican Republic, Grenada, Haiti, My address is where I'm, I'm Dominican. Martinique, Puerto Rico, <laughs> Puerto Rico, but it's really pinpoint in Jamaica, so, you know, I would love to be Puerto Rican, though. Shout out to the Puerto Ricans out there. Yeah. Yeah. So, it's very strong it's, in yeah. Jamaica. They just don't know... We, wow. we, we descendants of Jamaicans. <laughs> yeah. I want to know where that's coming from, but we got to look at your DNA matches to see who got it, who is on here. Yeah. I'm so confused wow. right now. I was not <laughs> expecting that. Links to the past. <laughs> oh my God. Ma, Ma, this. I don't even know what to do with this information. Like, am I supposed to like hang with the Jamaicans now? Am I supposed to be like, well, you know what? My great 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 is Jamaican, so you already know what that means. I don't know. Like, I don't. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> wow. What? I don't. Need, I'm stuck. I was not as that. If I'm surprised about anything on this test, I'm surprised about that. I was, mm -hmm. and it's the fact that it says highly likely match. Who would you make it, Grandma? I shouldn't be surprised. How much you want to bet it's somebody from Grandma's it probably, side? It may be, because that's where the more... Let the, me find out Grandma Loki was a Jamaican woman. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I got some research to do. <laughs> do you hear me? I got some research to do. Y'all don't judge us. I know y'all probably think, oh, she crazy. <laughs> Maybe, but you know what? I'm excited and I'm being very just vulnerable with you guys. This is a raw, unfiltered reactions right now. I, I was not expecting this. Wow. So that's like two generations. So this is maybe like four generations back. Or two. No, I'm tripping two generations back. Because 93 and 93, that's only two generations. But for me, it would be like four. For you, I don't know. It's been closer for you. Making me feel old. <laughs> <laughs> Not to make you feel old, but. <laughs> well, thanks a lot, Kate. What? All right, let me get off of here because now I'm gonna be stuck on here wow. trying to wrap my head around yeah, how we're Caribbean. Caribbean. So. I right, now see. Look, you need to split this with me. Now, now we really got to do the African ancestry DNA test. You need to split the cost with me. I don't want to pay for it by myself. That thing is expensive, yeah. okay? We African ancestry, if you get to this video, y'all need to run your sister a discount code, okay? We need some <laughs> discounts on that test because it's a little yeah. up there. Our African, no, besides the 
African hunter gatherer. So at this point, the only African that was in our DNA at this point was the African hunter gatherers. We didn't start seeing our West African come in until around 1820. What wow. is that about? I don't think mine is like that. This is yours. I think mine at least has some um, African at this point, way, way back. Mm -hmm. So that is a little bit interesting that you only had Southern East African and African hunter gatherers back then. That's crazy. I can't wait to go look at your stuff. I'm about to go home. <laughs> <laughs> From We are descendants of Caribbean. We were born there, so technically we can't say we're Caribbean, Caribbean. <laughs> but our peoples is Caribbean, which means that we might have cousins that still live in Jamaica today. That's crazy. You try, yeah. You trying to meet up? Because I need a trip to Jamaica. Let me go sleep on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go sleep on the couch because... That is crazy. So my Spanish might just be coming straight from you. That's and crazy. And there was a reason why I love Spanish music, Spanish people. Crazy. I love reggae. I gotta tell Deshauna this. I love Afro, Afro, Afro beats and mm -hmm. af Afro music. <laughs> That's I crazy. love it all. <laughs> Geography was not my forte in school. No. Let's be real. <laughs> Let's be real. I don't know. I don't know. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. So let me get back to this main page. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you are still rocking with us and it's been this far in the video, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Click that like button. If you haven't already joined to be a part of the crew, I don't know what you're waiting for, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button button honey okay so that you can always stay updated on when i post and while you're at it click the notification bell that way you can always see every time i upload a new video so i will be bringing more videos like this to you as well as obviously my music so if you have not checked out that go ahead and click on one of the videos over here or click on the playlist in the description box below that way you can see what we're getting into over here because we want you to be a part of the team so make sure you subscribe okay like this video like this video and if I've mentioned one of your ethnic groups so far and you want to give your people a shout out, make sure you drop a comment down in the comment section below and let us know who you are and where you're from. We want to know what you're repping, okay? So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for the next one and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Peace out. Let me know if you're my cousin. Yeah, let us know if you, <laughs> you're part of the fam. We need to know. If you are cousin, you know, let us know in the comments below. Muchísimo gracias for my Spanish people now that I know I'm Spanish, okay? <laughs> Alright, bye y'all. <laughs>